2.17 a.m. <laughs> Good morning. It is 2.17 a.m. on Thursday, May 12th, which it happens to be my birthday. And today, I'm going to attempt to film a day in the life. <laughs> I almost said what I do in a day, but that's not it. Yeah, so Thursdays, I get up at 2 in order to be at the bakery at 3. So that is something new. I, You guys know that I've been working at that farm since my last big-ish life update video when I had the pink hair. I've been still working at that farm, so it's been a little bit over a year now with this company. And I recently moved to the bakery that we just opened. So I worked at the farm for a solid year and did a lot of cool stuff in the greenhouse and the farmer's markets and all of that. And I actually have a little bit of footage from that stuff. Yeah, that was a really fun time. Working in the greenhouses as well as the farmer's markets, uh, that was a lot of fun. I, I honestly wish I had filmed more of it. I'm here now and I'm working in the bakery full time, which is awesome. It feels really, really good to be back in a commercial kitchen setting which honestly I don't think I like ever thought that I would say but it is really nice it's very different from like being a line cook and cooking things to order as a baker you just kind of get it all ready early in the morning and then the rest of the day is smooth sailing nothing ever has to be made like to order except for when we take special orders but then we know about it days in advance so it is very different from being like a line cook or something and I really enjoy it so far. The only thing is some mornings I definitely do not want to get out of bed at 2 a.m. But at least that's only one of my shifts a week. So we're good. <laughs> this morning I am packing myself a little bit of coconut water. I think I'm going to probably put this in a smaller bottle because I don't want to bring the whole thing. It's 34 ounces. I've been wanting to get some more minerals and electrolytes and hydration. Also going to bring this carrot ginger turmeric juice and I'm gonna put that in a smaller bottle as well and yeah that's what I'm bringing uh, with me today I'm gonna like cook and eat more food when I'm at work this is not my food for the day by any means um, and I'm also gonna make some coffee at work most likely because your girl needs a little pick-me-up this early in the morning all right check in in a minute Yeah. Yeah. 
15 cups? I don't know. Yeah, I was like so looking forward to some French vanilla coffee yesterday. First I was like, oh that's not too bad. And then I was wrong. <laughs> So I just got home from work. Um, today was a pretty chill day as we have been lately. We just got um, quite a bit of new help which has been nice. The workload is a lot more spread out. So yeah, it was a nice chill day. I just made some donuts, cinnamon rolls, churros, danishes, and baguettes, and an Italian herb bread. It was pretty nice, um, and I always bring home lots of goodies, which is a good thing and a bad thing. Yeah, I think now it's around noon, but I did just work a full nine-hour shift, which it's nice to be off so early, but now I'm like super tired and I don't know what to do with the rest of my day or if I really want to do anything, which is kind of, I don't know, it's my birthday. I feel like I should do something, but... At the same time, chilling out, relaxing could be just as nice, so we'll see what I get into later on. Probably going to take a nap before I even think about any of that. I don't know. We shall see. <laughs> And you can like tap, no, do it side the other way. Oh my god, mom. Now it is, <laughs> now it is, Sarah. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Can I go? Go. Yeehaw. <laughs> Look at our messy kitchen. Little Thanks. teeny cake. Birthday, Sarah. <laughs> Woohoo. So, it's getting late. Well, it's like 8 or 8.30 or something. But that's late for me. I had a great birthday. Uh, we got sushi for dinner, which was really nice. I was like thinking about sushi earlier today, and then my mom texted me asking if I wanted some. So of course, I was like, it's a sign. Let's eat some sushi tonight. And it was very good. And she got me um, an ice cream cake as well, which was like, you know, one of those like 
super dense sugary ones from the grocery store, but it was really good and um, yeah, I had a really good time. It was a nice like chill relaxing day, I got to work a little bit and make some money. It was good, it felt like a good birthday. Yeah, what else did we We watched a little bit of Outer Banks, uh, the show on Netflix. I don't usually get into those like cheesy shows like that, but that one really has hooked me. And we've been re-watching it because the new season is coming out soon. I think I'm probably just going to read a little bit, do a little evening meditation, and call it a day. I did take a little nap earlier, so it might be a little harder for me to fall asleep, but usually I don't have that issue, so... It's gonna be a good night of sweet dreams and get to wake up and go in at 8 o'clock tomorrow to bake. So, yeah, not so bad. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I am Divinity. You can follow me here at Divinity Shares on YouTube and I believe Divinity Shares on Instagram. I think I might have changed all my other social medias to be the same thing, but if not, you can find me some, one way or the other. I haven't been super active on like any social media lately, so I'm not sure which one to tell you to go to for the most activity, but Instagram is pretty much my go-to. Though I am really hoping to get back into regular uploads here on YouTube. I'm liking the long-form content and putting a little bit more production into that. I don't know, we'll see where it goes, because I never know, and it's kind of silly to make predictions like that. But thank you so much for being here along this journey with me and yeah, taking it as it comes just like I am. I appreciate you and yeah, thanks for joining me on my birthday.